Hey, my loves. It is your girl, Lady TVSG. And Happy New Year. Today is New Year's Day. Um, so, January 1st, 2018. We made it. Um, so, this is going to be a really quick video. And I mean, for real, for real, this time. It's not going to be a full 15 minutes. Um, I just wanted to let you guys know how I've been doing these last... Um, almost seven days since the last time I made a video. Um, as you guys can see, for whatever reason, my face is dry. So, I'm not even going to try to hide nothing. You guys, I told you, everything's just going to be real. My face is dry. Um, and it has a lot to do with my skin changing and probably a little bit of dehydration, even though I've been trying to drink as much as possible. Um... So, the other day, on the 30th, my husband and I went to my brother-in-law's um, Dirty 30, and we had a lot of fun. Um, and, um, but it's cold. It's so cold outside. So, Hubby and I are sick. Um, like, you got me sick, y'all. I didn't get him sick. Okay, our, our nieces and nephew and child got us sick. Okay, I'm lying. Um, so, I'm laying in bed. I've been trying to recoup, keep myself hydrated. Um, I had literally took some Tylenol, the, the pain medicine that we got from surgery. I had took that medicine um, probably like, what, two hours ago? Yeah. Something like that. And I took a, a quick nap because I was just like, I can't. I can't do this anymore. Okay, so, um, I don't have any stats for you. I won't have those until tomorrow because that's when I go to my follow-up appointment. Tomorrow is going to be the first day I'm able to actually eat some real food. I will be honest with you guys, and I know this is absolutely horrible, but I have had zero appetite, so I have eaten zero food in about a week. I know that's not good. I haven't even gotten any protein in. My ball. I just haven't eaten. Uh, but I will admit, too, these uh, shots... I've gotten on my nerves. Um, I can't even give them to myself anymore. So my mother-in-law has been doing it for me. Because it had got like to the point where it was too painful. Too tough to do. Too hard to enter like my own skin. Like I couldn't do it. Look you guys. This is how bad my skin is just dry. And I moisturize it as much as I possibly can. Um, you know. Wash my face and stuff. But whatever. Anyway. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, so we got sick, but I've been trying to keep myself like sweating it out, sweating out the cold and stuff. So hopefully it'll be gone soon. Tomorrow, like I said, is my follow up appointment. So, oh, excuse me. So tomorrow I will have weigh ins and stuff for you guys. Look, I just could have swore I just wiped this stuff off my face and it looked, oh my gosh, what is this? Oh, goodness. My face is just falling apart. Anyway. So. um, Let me tell you how I've been feeling. Like crap. Simply because I'm sick. Like, physically, I'm okay. I am having some pain around one of my incisions. And I'll go ahead and show you those. Um, and I noticed, uh, technically... Was it Sunday morning? Around 3 o'clock in the morning, I noticed that one of my incisions had opened a little bit, too. But I'll show you my incisions now. I'm laying down. not prob Probably not going to stand up, but I'll show you what my incisions look like. So, here you go. Um, so, this is the one that opened up. I can show you... Ew. So, I don't know if you guys can see it, but it opened and then that's whatever is on the band-aid. So, I need to change band-aids and clean it because that looks gross. But, um, this is the incision that's actually, or around the incision. All of this whole area is very, very tender. This one doesn't bother me at all. And the one up here is pretty much all the way closed. So, 
this is the only one that's bothering me. I still have some tenderness like around here on my left side. It's like, I don't know, it's weird. It's like a weird pain. And sometimes if I sneeze or cough or do anything, it is the most excruciating pain. And it feels like this incision is trying to like bust open or something. But other than that, I mean they don't really bother me but this one I definitely need to clean up I'm gonna actually take this band-aid off because it looks like it's <coughs> oozing something gross um uh, so I will be cleaning that in just a minute and I'm not allowed to use any kind of alcohol or anything so see that's I don't know if you guys can really see it let me put it in the light and y'all know I was big, so I ain't worried about the rolls. But that's what it's looking like. But it's looking like it closed more than what it was even the other day. Um, but anyways, <coughs> um, past all that, I physically can move a million times better. Um, when we went to my brother-in-law's party, um, a lot of... We were cute. Um, I'll try to find a way to insert a picture of us. But um, we, um, I mean, some of his family members who hadn't seen me since way before the surgery were like, girl, you look different. You look slimmer. Thanks, boo. Um, but, yeah, like I said, I don't know anything about any weigh-ins or anything like that. Um, you can see my little... My little Coke bottle is coming back, baby. Yeah, yeah. Um, Y'all don't mind me. I'm just crazy. But I'm really not feeling whatever this is on my eye. Like, yeah, something bit me while I was asleep or something. I don't know. I was a little hungry. Oh, my husband said it was him. He was a little hungry, huh? So you start nibbling on people, do you? That's how you feel? Mm -hmm. Y'all want to see hubby? Oh, you can't. I don't know if you can. Hold on. Can you see him? They don't need to see me. Can you I'm see too him? pretty for the camera. Oh my gosh. Let's turn it off of him because he said that. <laughs> he says he's too pretty for the camera. Really? Whatever, y'all. Anyways, um, but so we have a lot planned for this 2018 year. Um... Our puppy, well, she's not really that much of a puppy anymore, but our puppy will be giving birth in a couple days, maybe the next, within the next week. So that's exciting. It's her second litter. She is pregnant this time by our male dog. We don't know who she was pregnant by the first time. It's like, it was a dog that looked just like her, but we don't know him. And, um... So now she's pregnant by our male dog. So we'll see. He's brown. Uh, he's a brown brindle uh, pit bull. And she's a black and white pit bull. So we'll see how these ones come out. And she's definitely fatter than what she was with the first four that she had. So I'm assuming she's having way more than four this time. I hope she have at least. I want her to have at least six to eight. You know. It makes her a real OG this time. Um, and she pushed him out for her first time. She pushed him out pretty quick. Um, so that's one thing that's happening this year um, that we're looking forward to. Um, hubby and our son's birthdays are in March. So we'll be doing something big. We'll also be, well, we're before we move, um, we're going to do some, we're doing a party of some sort for my husband. I was listening to the car outside because I was trying to figure out who that was. Um, anyways, uh, we were, we're so we're either gonna do a big birthday party or some kind of family get together before we move, and then we are moving out of state again. Um, so we will be vlogging and doing all of that for um, when that time comes. Uh, anything else exciting supposed to be happening before the move, babe? I don't know. Uh, possibly just my party. Maybe. Depending on what I decide to do. I don't know. 
That's what I'm saying. But before your party, that's like moving time. So before the party, is there anything else that we had planned? No, we're pretty lame. We're pretty lame. Um, so we don't have anything planned other than that. But um, another goal that we were just discussing earlier is uh, you by this summer. Okay, I'm gonna switch to the big TV. By this summer, we're um, gonna try to do the Bahamas. So Ooh. that'll be fun. Um, Can we leave now? Where to go to the Bahamas? Yeah, I'm sure. Let's we'll just, we'll get our passports and everybody show up. So we'll just be there for the like Bahamas. six or seven months. It's okay. Yeah, sure. Um, I would love to go back to Hawaii too sometime soon. Just because that's always a place of choice for me. I've been like nine times, but that doesn't make it mean any different. I, it, I mean, it feels like the first time every time you go. It's awesome. um, My first time was amazing. I it, want to go back. It, it was amazing? Mm -hmm. It was amazing. He loved it. Yes. Um, But that was way back in like 2009, so that's the last time we went. So it's 2018. It's time to go back. Um... I plan, we plan on doing probably a lot more traveling starting this year. Um, I told him what I think would be a good idea is to do two trips a year. One with our child, one with just us every year. That's our goal. You ain't leaving my baby out. <laughs> so we're going to do two trips a year. One with our son and one with just us as a couple. So... We'll see how that goes, too. Okay, fine. I can't leave him. I'll, then I'll just leave you, too. Y'all both stay. I'm gone. I'll be back. You got life messed up. I've been on a business trip. Your job doesn't travel. What? Your job doesn't acquire you to travel. Well, seeing how right now I don't have one. Exactly. I got time to travel. See? So my job always required me to travel. I can't stand him, y'all. <laughs> anyway, um, JoJo. See, kids are good for something. You gotta call their name when you need them to do something. Call him in here to be a slave, y'all. I don't need him to be a slave. I just need him to do me a favor. Whatever this is under my eye keeps looking like it's getting bigger, y'all. My skin is peeling. Like it's like, oh, that's a mole. But like, whatever I do, it seems like. My skin's just getting drier and drier. Anyways, I think I've been doing good on my fluid intake, but not so much anything else. I suck at everything else. I'm just telling you the truth. But like I said, I tried not to make this a 15 minute video. It's already 13 minutes, but um, I just want to say happy new year's to you guys. I just wanted to do a quick update on how I've been feeling and what my incisions look like and all that good stuff. I will have a video tomorrow as my two week post op um so that you guys can get the updates and the stats and all that stuff because i want to know too um on you know we know the pre-surgery weight was 272 uh day of surgery was 261 um and so Let's see where we're at tomorrow. Only God knows. Um, so I look forward to um, talking to you guys tomorrow. Don't forget to comment. Hit that bell for the notifications whenever I make a video. Like, subscribe, and share these videos. And there will be way more content to come. I promise you guys. I told you guys I keep everything real. I'm not going to sugarcoat nothing. I'm not going to edit stuff. Um, at least not right now. Because no point. But. Uh, you going to have to make some edits fooling with me. Like that. I'm going to need to edit. Anyways. Damn it. Point is. Right now you guys are just getting the raw everything. So. Comment, like, share, subscribe, and don't forget to hit that bell so that you guys can get the updates. And I'll be back with a video tomorrow on all of my stat updates. Love you guys.